Welcome back with an update on the Piton de la Fernace eruption. Um, so let's get to it. There's some spectacular lava fountain the other day. And you know this is going to be thumbnail. So, here we go. That didn't interrupt, we're good. Anyways, the activity increased from low levels to pulsating lava fountains yesterday. At night, glowing ballistic pyroclastic juvenile fragments traced parabolic ballistic paths as they fall back to the main cone walls and illuminate the whole edifice. The lava flow continues to effuse from the cone, opening at its south base and making it directly into lava tunnels. Satellite-based measurements of SO2 concentrations in the atmosphere show elevated SO2 plumes ejected by Piton de la Fernace. Sulfur dioxide emissions reached um, to 1,500 tons on the 1st and extended about 400 kilometers from the volcano, which would be about 248 miles. The estimated height of the gas and water vapor plume is a is reported at approximately less than seven kilometers. The seismic network re registered three te volcano tectonic earthquakes over the past 24 hours. Weak inflation continues to be detected. So, with that, that does seem to be it for right now. Stay safe out there. See you in the next video. Bye.